Hello everyone, welcome back to another Royal High video on this channel and today a first part to the Halloween event for Royal High has been put into the game and it is the designer boutique candy hunt. Now this looks super exciting. It's If any of you were around during the Easter event, I believe this is going to be pretty much the same or similar to that event where we would travel to home stores collect different uh, candies or back then it was uh, easter eggs and once you collected them all you can come back into the game and get prizes so that's essentially what this is now of course the beginnings of my channel here um, I uploaded a bunch of different easter egg uh, guide videos and some of you may remember that time and be subscribed from then so um it's come full circle <laughs> so here we are what i want to do though with this video probably already know by the title is i want to do a mega tutorial guide because last time it took up a lot of my time uploading lots of different video guides to these home stores so what i wanted to do is i wanted to do a really in-depth tutorial in one video so you can come to this one video um, and use the timestamps um, in the pinned comments and the description to travel around the video to find what home store you're looking for and what you need help with so that's what I'm going to be doing here so I'm going in first time here I have not seen any of these home stores yet I know an amazing amount of effort has been put into updating them for this Halloween event so I am really looking forward to it. I can't wait to see what um, candies we can find here and also to just take a look at these home stores because people have put a lot of work into them. Okay, I also have to add a epilepsy warning. I'm sure that you saw the one that was at the beginning of this video, but I just want to make sure anybody who deals with epilepsy, I just want to remind you that there are flashing lights in these home stores. So please be very careful and aware that that may be a problem for you. I also want to mention some of these egg locations may be out of date at this point because it's taken me a few days to edit and record this video. Um, I've done it over several days. Um, I've been really challenged with disk space on my computer and just, you know, trying to keep up with editing it so I'm sure some of these locations are just out of date I know some of these home stores change their locations daily and I mean I I, I don't want to be one of those youtubers who has to you know constantly keep up with that um so yeah and I think there may actually be some disqualifications to some home stores so some of the home stores that are in this video you may not actually be able to access anymore because they were disqualified for breaking some of the rules for the game now I don't know if that's true um it's something I've heard so if there is actually any home stores you can't access that may be the reason why so just so you are aware so Barbie actually mentioned um on a comment somewhere that any of the accessories that are unaccessible anymore may be released for free at some point but um, I don't think that's a guaranteed thing so yeah just so you're aware of that so yeah uh, please be aware of all of that that I um, have said there and I just want to say again this has taken me many many hours um, a lot of stress um, so I do apologize again if you can't find the eggs in the places that they might have been for me but they're not there for you um, that's it's completely out of my control um, but I don't want to be uploading um, candies videos tutorials all month like I did for Easter and I keep calling them eggs because in my mind it's still the Easter egg hunt I can't believe it's like several months after and we're doing this whole Halloween event anyway I'm gonna stop rambling and get into this video the timestamps are in the comments they're in the description um, so yeah, you can fast forward and see which egg tutorials you actually need to do and which ones you're struggling with. So anyways, here is the video. So let's get started with the first one here. See, there are many, many, many different home stores. So I am, you know, this video is going to take uh, a long time. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put down a list in a notebook that I've got <laughs> and write down all of the ones that we 
do. First of all, we're going to start off with Mugglow's home store, which is Flatline. We can also see here which stores we have not completed or completed, so that's going to be really helpful. Right, so here we are at Flatline Home Store, which is Mugglow's home store. Um, we have 49 candies to collect from here, so let's get started. There is one right as we spawn next to this tree, so let's get this one. We have one, and then right next to this tree. There's Antelique hiding behind the tree. Oh, <laughs> they're animated. Okay, let's keep walking this way. Now, there's a sign that says Flatline Garments here. There's a tiny little candy behind there. Let's walk over this direction and see what we have. We have a candy right here. And right behind these pumpkins too. There's a candy right here. Let's make sure we check everywhere. So let's head up onto this next layer here and see what we have. There's a candy right on the corner here. Oh, and there is one. If you go to this sign, there is a candy right on here. Um, I couldn't see it there, but as you walk up to this, sort of in this location, you can get that candy that is located there. There's a candy right here in this corner. There's a candy here. And then we can't go any further, so let's head up onto the next layer. A candy here. Candy right next to Twin Yard here. Candy right in this corner here. There's a candy to the left of the house, just located there. There's a candy next to this tree. Can't go up any further here. Let's walk to the back of the house. Let's walk all the way around and see what we have. There is one located on the left of the patio. Can we get behind here? No. Oh, I'm in the home store for some reason. Oh, is this a secret room? Who is she? Why is she the sensational beef girl? That's who. Tweet beef girl 2019. <laughs> This is really cool, we've got a little secret room here. So yeah, you saw where I walked in, and there's a candy right on the end of that rope there. That's really cool. So yeah, tweet hashtag beefgirl2019 if you find this room. Anything else up here? Oh, of course there's one on the steps right there. And let's just check around to this side. But I have spotted one right here. And then one behind this tree too. Um, and let's check inside the home store now. We have another 29 to find. Okay, so this model is holding one in the hand. If I can get to it. There we go. <laughs> There's one on the foot of this one. That one's quite well hidden. There are two on this pumpkin that make it look like ears, so let's get both of those. There's one in this model's hand. There's one on this model's head. Let's check behind these. Ah, there's one right next to the foot here. There's a candy hidden in this pumpkin uh, collection. There's a candy right here. There's a candy right on this pumpkin's nose. Candy right next to this pumpkin. There's a candy right next to the foot of this model. I've just spotted one here in this sort of slime pool. There's a candy right on the back of this model. There's a candy right on the head of this model that I somehow missed. <laughs> That's to the right of the doorway. Um, makeup room doorway, I mean. Uh, there's this strawberry candy right in front of that door. Oh, yeah, I've just spotted it. There it is, right on the hands. Right, let's check inside this makeup room. Might be a couple of candies in here. There's one on the pumpkin next to the door. Oh, whoops. And one on this pumpkin. 
Um, there's a candy right here. There's a candy in this cauldron. There's a candy behind this candle. There's one right on the face of this makeup here. And I'm gonna have to go and look around for the remaining five that I haven't seen yet. Oh, here's one. Nutesta's uh, hidden one on top of her head there. I've just spotted one on the roof. Now I do wonder how I can get up there. Ah, I can get up on this tree here. Perfect. Okay, so go on that tree, walk along the edge to the roof here. So on top of this part. Um, how can we get up from this bit? Oh, I did it. Okay, guys, you need to get some other people down here if you want to do this quicker because I can't be bothered to wait to try and get up here and climb up the side. Um, so try and jump on somebody's head and get up that way. There's a candy right on the top of this roof here. Ah, I've just found another one right on the foot of this yellow one that's next to the entrance door. I found the last one everyone, it was right here on this um, railing. So let's get that. You found all the candy. After you finish shopping for your favourite Halloween outfits, take your broomstick back to Royal High to obtain your prize. Awesome. Guys, if you'd like to actually support the designers and to get more updates like this, just to support them so they can keep doing what they're doing, make sure you, if you have the means, that is, to maybe give them a donation or buy an outfit from these home stores because it really supports these artists. We can now travel back to Royal High and see what item we got or whether we got diamonds. Okay, here is our prize. Royal High Halloween event. You collected all the candy at Designer Boutique. A flatline store, awesome job. Your prize is candy explosion and 250 diamonds. Amazing, so let's take a look. Oh wow, okay, so it looks like I'm being orbited by like candy corn, a little um, <laughs> bunny lollipops, which I'm guessing is like Muggalo's like signature thing, isn't it? Oh, that's so cool. I like this, I like this a lot. So that's the accessory you get from the Flatline home store. Okay, so this is Honey Milk's home store. And this is the next one that I'm gonna be going around. There's only 25 in this one, so this one should go a little bit quicker. There's a candy right as you spawn, right there. There's a candy on the counter here. Oh, if I can get up, there we go. And let's check this counter thoroughly so we don't miss anything. There's a candy right on the foot of this model. Is that one right? I think that's one right up on that chandelier. You see that there? That's definitely one. I can get to it. <laughs> um, there's candy right here in this corner. There's a candy right here in this corner. And on this side, there's one in this corner too. If I can get to it, there we go. And I think there's one on that chandelier up there again. Right there. There we go. So let's move on. There's a candy right on this stall. There's a candy on that shelf up there. Might just be able to catch that. Right there. There's one right on the floor of this doorway. There's one next to the foot of this model. There's one right here. There's one right on the floor here. There's one right on the floor here. There's one next to this handbag. Ah, there's one right here. There's a lot of people, so um, I keep missing them. But there is one here. Yeah, going to first person, that might be the easiest thing to do there. There's one right on the floor here. One on this stool. Oh, I'm sitting on it. <laughs> One on top of this plant. There we go. One on top of this cabinet. There's one right here um, where this person has gotten stuck. <laughs> oh, 
I just found one apparently. Um, I'm not sure where that was. I'll have to go back in the footage and slow that down. It was either on this model or just on the floor. Oh, there was one that I missed, which was <laughs> kind of obvious right there. So we only have one left to find now. That's what I was saying to you guys about the fact that once you get to a lesser amount of candies that you need, it gets harder because you're kind of just looking randomly. Ah, I found it. Okay, it's on this shelf behind this bag. And there we go. After you finish shopping for your favourite outfit, take your broomstick back to Royal High. Okay, so let's go see what we won. Okay, so from Honey Milk's home store, you win 500 diamonds, which is a very decent amount of diamonds there. This next one is Mahalo's home store. I hope I said that right. So let's go check out this candy hunt. Here we are, there are 23 to collect here. There's a candy right here. There's a candy right here. To the right side, there's a candy next to this tree. There's a candy on this corner. There's a candy right in the corner to the left of the home store. There's a candy at this tree. There's a candy next to this tree. And there's a candy to the right of this door. Okay, let's go look inside now. There's one right on this platform. There's one right in this corner. There's one right in this corner over here. There's one right here. There's one in the hand of this these two mod well just the one model there's one right on this edge as you walk in go straight there's one next to this model and there's one that looks like a hair bow on this model right here There's one right at the bottom of this sign and in this corner. Also one right on these jackets and one right on these models. There is one in the centre of here, one in this corner and one right here and that is all of them there you go that one we did rather quickly okay so from mahalo's home store we won the kawaii deben horns and 250 diamonds these are the horns and they have like a little symbol on there and yeah they're really nice i like those a lot let's go to siskella's 40 candies in this home store so this one's going to take a little longer i've spotted one right on the canopy overhang what are they called i don't know there is one here right here so let's get on and let's jump up and get this one right up here i think there is one on this pumpkin so let's walk across right here any more one right in this corner down here Okay, so there's a candy right to the right of the building, right there, and of course one massive one next to this door. Let's check on top of this. There's one right here. Uh, that might be it for all of the ones outside. So let's actually go into the home store. So let's go in and check it out. There's one right in this corner of the window display. Here we go. And one really well hidden here. Well, if we come around the front, um, we would have spotted that. There's one massive one right as you walk into the door behind this desk. There's one behind this pumpkin and one in front of this display. There's one on the floor here. One on the floor here. 
There's one behind the pumpkin next to the door. There's one behind this display. There's one up here. Let's check up there. I think there's one on this side. Yep, there it is. There's one there too. Oh, I'm stuck. <laughs> there we go. There's a candy right here. There's a candy behind this cauldron. There's a candy right here. Oh, I like that jacket. There's a candy next to these. There's a candy right in the corner down here. A candy up on top of this. There's a candy right here. Candy behind Siskella on top of Asteria next to Astrograph on the floor there. There's one behind these models, one behind this pumpkin, and also one behind this clothing rack. There's one right here behind this clothing rack too and behind this tree in the corner. Uh, there is one right up here if I can find a way to get up. But there is one next to this record player on the floor. And one behind this big clothing display. Um, how can I get up here? Can I climb onto the models maybe? like that that's probably best there we go we have 36 so there are four more and I've spotted three of them there's one here also one on top of this model's head there's also one on the corner here ah I spotted it it camouflaged in but it was kind of obvious um, it's right up top of here so that's the last one Let's go back and see what prize we got. We got the cute kitty ears and 250 diamonds. Amazing. So let's take a look at those. Oh, look at these. Oh, they're really cute. So this is the prize you get from Sis Keller's home store. Okay, so let's try Slink Izzy's apparel's closet. Oh, I can already tell the lighting's going to give me a bit of trouble in here, trying to find things. Very glowy, but very dark, so it's going to be a bit difficult, this one. Uh, there's one right in the corner over here. Luckily, there's only 22, so we don't have too many to find on this home store. Ah, there's one... Oh, I touched the water and died, apparently. <laughs> there's a candy right here. Oh, it's the skeleton. <laughs> yeah, be careful with that guy. He kills you. Okay, so from this entrance, I can't see any on these models. I'm not touching the skeletons. There's one next to this tree. Okay, let's follow this path down. I think that's one right there. Yeah. Alright, I've turned my computer brightness all the way up so I can see what I'm doing. Okay, so there's a little podium down here with candy in front of it and on top of whatever this thing is. I don't even know what that is. Uh, let's get up and jump down from there. There we go. Uh, there's one on top of this uh, shelving unit and also a candy right here. Okay, so over here there's a candy right here. And there's a little pathway down there. I think they did this for Easter too. Yep, there's one right onto this thing. Let's walk down here. There's that one. Okay, this is very glowy um, and it kind of hurts my eyes to look at, but there is a candy right here. Yeah, I'm kind of sensitive to bright lights, so this is um, 
too bright for me. <laughs> but the home store is very well designed. I do like it. Um, okay, there's a candy right here. Oh, there's one right behind here too. Let's check this graveyard. Okay, there's a candy. If you walk around to the back of the home store, it's right here. Let's look inside where I can actually see. There is a candy on this uh, model stand here. Right on top of this model. Of course, right here too. In the middle of here. One right here. Okay, that's looking like that's the only ones left inside. Um, there may be one on the roof. Yeah, here it is. I think there was one from Easter there too. Okay, so that's our last one that we needed. So let's go back to Royal High and see what accessory or diamonds that we won. So from Slinkazy's home store, we won 1300 diamonds, which is an amazing prize. So there you go. Okay, so we have, I feel like this is a new, yeah. <laughs> to say new a okayish designs home store so let's go see what this one is i really like this thumbnail i like the red and white we have 18 in here so this one won't take too long let's go wait for it to load in okay i spotted one behind here right there let's check behind these ones yep this one right there okay let's go to the left first there's one right here and there's also one right here. There's one below the stairs. There's one here and one here. And also one in the middle of these models. Let's check the back. One behind these models. And one right at the back here. And this one right over here. Okay, let's go check up the stairs and see what's up here. Okay, there's one right on the corner here to the left and one behind these models. Let's check if there's any over this way. Yep, one right at the end down here. Four left to go, and there's one right over here. There's one over here. And there's one here. One behind these models. And that is all of them. Let's head back and see what we won. So the prize from the OK Shame store is 1300 diamonds. Okay, next let's head on over to Girl Mangoes. Okay, here we are and let's start looking for these candies. There's one right on this deck chair. If we can get to it, there we go. One behind the G. Now we'll walk left of the home store and there's a big palm tree here, the candy behind it. Let's check down these stairs. Ah, there's one right on this towel down here. Uh, there's one below the bridge here. There we go. It was right there if you didn't spot it. Uh, there's one hidden right here, just to the right of the building. That's as far as we can go that way. Ah, and there's one behind this uh, donate sign. There's a candy right on Snapchat Girl 84's grave here. Let's check over this bridge. On the left behind this pumpkin there is a candy. At the foot of this chair there's a candy. And to the right behind this bench there's a candy. Here we go. So let's take a look inside now. There is a candy inside this pumpkin you can walk into, so that might be a hard spot. There's a candy to the left of the door behind these clothing models. 
Let's keep looking in this direction. There's one behind this model here. Ah, and I just walked past this one, but on this lantern, there is one. Next to the skeleton, there's a candy. I hope I didn't die by touching this. There we go. How about the back here? Oh, on the spider. <laughs> Camouflaged in quite well there. Okay, and this palm tree in the corner to the right, there's one right there. There's a candy right here. Okay, I'm going to check underwater in case there's any. Okay, there is one underwater just on this pillar here. So it is located um, right on the corner to the left. So where this path meets this platform, it's on this corner. Okay, so in this corner out here on this lantern, there is a candy. Oh my god, we all found it at the same time. It's right here. We'll just wait for everybody to get it, but <laughs> it's right there. <laughs> there it is. Way! <laughs> <I can't. laughs> yay, finally. Let's go see what prize we got. 650 diamonds, yay. Please excuse me for the sound of the hurricane outside. We've been forecast the back end of a hurricane. So like a very weak tropical storm uh, in the UK. So that's fun. Um, just going to ignore it and carry on with these home stores. Let's go to Marlena's clothing next. Okay, so there is 40 different candies in this one. And let's get started. One right here. It kind of looks like a rock, but it's a candy. Oh, there's a maze. There's a candy here. Let's go through the maze first. We could cheat. <laughs> there's a candy right in this corner. Candy in this corner. And run right at the end. I think that's all. Check this pumpkin again. Yeah, okay, let's get out of this maze. Okay, right over here there's a candy. And here there's a candy. And here there's a candy. And in this graveyard, there is one here, one here, one behind here, and one in this corner. Some very nice Halloween clothes on this home store. Let's check behind this uh, graveyard now. There's one behind it, just here. One on top of this pumpkin. One behind this pumpkin. There's one behind this tree here too. Ah, and there's one over here that I missed. Just to the left of this little area here. Let's go inside. This is a big home store. Okay, there is one right as you come in to the right. There's also one to the left, just sitting between here. On top of this platform, there is a big candy. One right in this corner to the left. There's one on top of this um, outfit here. And also one right next to it. There's a candy on this platform here. One in the middle of all of these clothes. And also one just above it here. There's another just right next to it. And then walking in a straight line from there, there's also one on the ground just there. To the left of that, there is one over here. Now let's take a look in this little section over here. So there's one on the corner. There's one right in the top right corner of this room. There's one on the floor here. There's also one on this edge of this one here. Okay, and there's a candy right at the top up here. Just located there. Let's look to the right of the room now. There is one candy right in the centre of here. 
one behind this piece of clothing. There's one on top of this pumpkin. One behind this mannequin. There's one I missed just right of the door on top of this um, lighting piece up here. Oh, and there's one that I completely walked past. This is the last one right here. So let's go see what prize we have gotten for this one. Okay, so for Marlena's home store, we win 850 diamonds. Okay, let's now go to Arctic's home store. This is Art Ziggs, I can hardly say that right, home store. And there are 30 different ones here. So let's get started. There's a scary tunnel that um, I'm gonna have to go down in a second. Let's check out the slime pool though. There's a candy right to the left of this exit tunnel. Ah, nearly walked past that one, right in between these deck chairs. Right in the corner over here, there's one, and there's also one just underneath these slides. There is one, um, right here. Now do you see this, how you can see through here? Hollow wall. So let's follow this around and see what's, oh, okay, maybe it's like a parkour thing. Alright, let's try that again. There's one right in the corner, can you see that? Right there. You get to it, there we go. Let's jump. There's one right over here, look. Oh, someone just shoved me into the thing. Thank you. Okay, let's try that again. Is there any in this part? I can't see any here. And one right here. So I think that's all in here. So let's teleport back. And we're now at the other end of this home store. So from here, let's take a look. So there's one right in the corner over here. Okay, there's one on this bench right over here. Okay, so let's take a look in this first door here. This one maybe? Can we get in here? Oh, there's doors here. Okay, so in this store, there's a candy on the foot of this outfit. These are really beautiful. I love these. I really like that jacket. Oh, and there's a candy right in the corner over here. There's also a candy next to this. Okay, let's check next door. This model has one in the hand. Let's check across the street in this door. There's one right as you walk in, just there. Also in this corner up here too. It's a candy to the sides of this pumpkin. Let's check this door. There's one right up here. One next to this pumpkin. One in this corner. And let's check across the street. There's one right next to the door. One under the stairs here, one next to this model, right on the floor here. Let's go upstairs. One right as you walk up. Uh, one on this cork board. Ooh! <laughs> I mean, you can do it that stylishly if you'd like to. <laughs> I think that's all for up here, so there's probably some that I've missed. Okay, so in this store, there's one right in the corner down here. And let's check this one again. Ah, yes, right as we walk in, I missed that one. Let's check all of these again, in case I did miss one. Ah, yeah, there's one right on the foot of Miss Riley Lane. Ah, okay, I missed one in this end store over here, right at the foot of this. I'm sure I did check there though. Okay, I found the last one. It is on top of this tray and there we go. That is all of the candies in Arc Tit Arc Zit. 
Arts, <laughs> Optics, Home Store. So let's go see what we won. So it looks like we got an accessory, the Nom Nom chocolate bar, and we also got 250 diamonds. So let's take a look at what this accessory is. There. <laughs> awesome. So the Nom Nom chocolate bar is from Artix Home Store. Alrighty, next up, let's go to Pastelia's Designs Home Store. Oh, I love this music very boppy okay um i also love this bag i like how it's clear okay let's get started there's one in this corner over here Ding! <laughs> one floating over this way oh there's a tiny little one next to this cat let's take a look oh and there's one on top of this cat's head <laughs> let's take a look inside There's one floating over here. Okay, let's go next door. There's one right in the center. Let's go in this store over here. One floating at the back here. And next door, of course. One in the center on the cauldron. Okay, there is a big one right in the center of this store. Okay, behind this red tent there is a little candy. Let's check out this tent over here. Oh, there's a big one in here. I can see one right at the top of here. Boop! Okay, let's check out this store. One on top of this fountain. Let's check this one out. One on this mannequin right here. On top of this pumpkin. And one in the center on the cauldron. Okay, next door, there's one on top of this mannequin right here, just on the top there. Okay, and next door to that. One on this mannequin right where the unicorn is. Let's follow this through. There's one right next to this lighting package. Okay, let's check outside. Is there any behind this sign? Yes, there is one behind the E of the Pastelia sign. Okay, let's keep going to the right here. Dude, we just came out of that store. Okay, behind this corn, there is one. Behind this pumpkin, there is one. Also, behind this, um, what are these called? I'm just gonna call it a board for now. There's one in that hole. Okay, let's go in this store. There's one right next to this cauldron. And then next door in this shop, there's one at the foot of this mannequin right here. Next door, one right down here. There's one on top of this cauldron. And on this side, there is one also. <gasps> this is a spinel costume. Need it. Oh, and there's one behind these pumpkins here. Okay, there is one between these doors over there floating, but I can't get behind them right now. So I'll come back for that one. This little kitty down here has got a little one in its mouth. There's a big one here in this empty store. Okay, let's walk around the back. There's a tiny little one behind here. That's located, let's zoom out so I can show you. Um, just if you're facing the little graveyard uh, towards this big building, it's just to the right of there. Okay, let's take a look around here. This is the one we spotted earlier. And also in this big tent over here. There is a rather big one. Let's keep walking around. A tiny little one up here. That's to sort of the top left of this uh, graveyard. Let's keep going. I 
spot a little one over there. I'll just make sure I'm not missing any. Yep, there's one down here. Here's this tiny little one. Can we swim in this or do we die? No, we can swim in it. Okay. Oh, there are candies hidden on the water. Okay. So here's the one underneath the sort of entranceway platform. I'm going to swim to the right here so I can get on this ship because this is suspicious and I see a candy up there. I do wonder how I'm going to get up. Ah, okay. There's a tiny little one up here. Oh, okay, so there's a cat with a candy on top of its head just right here that I missed. All right, so just in front of this graveyard here, there is one on this tree. All right, I found another one on top of this pumpkin stem up here. And now we've got one left to find, which I'm guessing is going to be in sort of a similar obscure place like that. I've literally been looking for this candy for nearly an hour, over an hour actually. It has been over an hour now. You can hear the frustration in my voice. Um, yeah, <laughs> such a relief. <laughs> okay, so from Pastel Leas, Pastel Home Store, we get the Nightmare Witch Hat and 250 diamonds. Ooh, I love, this looks awesome. Okay, let's go to Rockstar's home store next. Okay, there are 22 in this home store, so let's get started. Okay, let's follow this path along here. This is really spooky. Ooh, this is scary. There's one on this chain. It was just there. Um, okay, let's keep going. Ooh, a spider. See that one right there? Just on its leg. Wow, this home store is amazing. There's a candy up here on these boxes. If we can get to it. I'm in the wall. <laughs> Help! There we go. Let's keep walking around the outside first. There's one in there. Okay, and there's one right here. Here's a candy. Oh, something's leaked. Oh, there's a candy right in this corner there. And one on here. Well, there's a tiny little one in this puddle here. I can almost miss it. Okay, now let's go up here. Okay. There's one behind this pumpkin. There's a candy behind this one. Mangoes and one behind his pumpkin and pastela and one on top of this pumpkin here. Oh, you see this little guy on here? That is sneaky. See, there's one here too. Look, there's one, there's one right there. There's also one on this side. Okay guys, so if you walk all the way over from here and you walk straight down, there's a little secret bit under here. With a spider's web and this is very spooky. And there is a little candy on the floor here. And there's one over here. I think that is all for this little cave. Okay, I found the last one and it's right behind here. Just sneakily hiding. Hang on, let me get this way in. Gonna have to walk sideways. You see that there? Right there. There we go. That's all of them in this home store. In Rockstar's home store. So let's go see what we won. 
2,200 diamonds. That's a good amount of diamonds. All right, next up, let's go to Miss Mudman. All right, here we are. I'm gonna use this candelabra to try and look around. There are some hands illuminating all the way up here, so let's um, take a look. I don't know if this is a parkour thing because uh, I hope there isn't any more that I've got to find around on these. Oh, okay, I did it. <laughs> Thank God. I see a candy on this green spider. Boop. All right, let's go into the home store now. There's a candy here. So candy over this way. Woo! <laughs> well, if you wanted to scare me, you you definitely did it there. Here's another candy. Okay, there's something. Oh, I see one over there. Let's get back up. Uh, I don't like the sound of that. Here's one. This is creepy. Here's another one. By the eye tree. And by this tree at the back of the store there is one. I'll check all the way around. Okay, this is to the right of the home store and there is a candy just behind this tree. All right, let's go take a look in the actual store now. There's a candy right over here. There's a candy on, there's a candy on this shelf. A candy over here. Okay, here's one at the end of the stairs. Go to the back room and then we'll go upstairs. Okay, there's one on the wall here. Okay, there's a candy up here where the monster eyes are. One right in front of these skeletons. There's a candy on the hand here that I missed. Okay, let's check upstairs. There's one on the table here, right here. There's one over here. one right next to the door here too. All right, so on this top portion up here, let's take a look. There's one just here. There's candy on this cobweb. I'm a bit scared when it flashes blue like that. Here we go. <laughs> All right, up this ramp. There's one right there. I can get up here. Just keep going to the top. That's the scariest looking cat I've ever seen. It's gonna it's gonna attack me. I Ah Ah and here is the last one. It is right here and I walked past it several times. Here we go, so let's go see what we won. Okay, so we won these spinning web boppers and 250 diamonds, so let's Take a look. These are awesome. I like these a lot. All right, so cold soul next. All right, so the first one as you spawn in is behind these little pumpkins here. There are two on here. Well, there's three on here actually. There's one on this pumpkin sign. There's one in this candy bucket. We have to steal it from them. There's one over here in this little corner area. Oh, and through the window, this cracked window here, there is a little candy. 
There's a candy in this ghost. He's going to have to catch up to him. There you go. I think he cycles every so often, so just wait around in that area, he should come. And let's go inside the home store itself. There's one right on the end of this clothes rack. On the O of the collection sign here, there is a candy. There's a candy right here. There's a candy in this box. Just jump through the painting there. And over on this side, there's a candy. Okay, there's one big yellow one on here. All the way up the top, there's a candy up this ladder. See this witch flying around here? Let's do it, catch her somehow. There we go. The spider has got a little candy in its mouth just there. Okay, so this little square, if you go into it, you actually fall down this hole. And I was wondering, why do I still have five remaining? Like, there's surely a room I'm missing. It turns out there was. So there's one, two, three candies. This guy's holding one here too. And there's one right at the bottom here too. And that's all of them from this home store. So the accessory we win is the sparkly body chain and 250 diamonds. You can see what I mean, it's kind of like that um, K-pop sort of fashion harness kind of thing, which is really cool. All right, let's go to Ghoul's Home Store next. Okay, there are only 20 to find here, so it shouldn't take too long. There's one at the end of this tunnel here. Oh! Okay, so if you go into this grave, there is a candy just above here. Okay, so this model up here is holding a piece of candy. Let's try and somehow get up there. Here we go. I'm just here. There's a big candy just behind this Angie Plet gravestone. Let's go down into here. Candy right at the bottom. And then one right next to the potions. Oh, there's a candy there. All right, let's go through this maze. Apparently it's scary. Oh, here's a candy. Hi. <laughs> and I, oop. <laughs> right, let's go through. Now find our way out. Here's a big, big candy. Okay, so next to this coming soon sign, there's a little candy in the flower bed here. Okay, and that big hand up here, which is located just over the street from the giant pumpkin, the hand is holding a, a big sweet. So let's check this star first. There's one behind the pumpkins here, and a candy, and there's a candy right on the top of here. Let's see if we can somehow climb up. There we go. Right, let's check next door. There's a candy on the top of this little model's head here. And there's a candy inside this display. And let's check this store. This little model over here is holding one in the hand. There's one on this big sofa here. On the staircase, on the staircase there's a big candy. Okay, so there is one right here. So that was hidden in that little basket. Okay, I've spotted the last one. I was, it was in plain sight the entire time. There we go. Got them all. Let's head back and see what we got. So we got 1300 diamonds from that boutique. Okay, so the next home store that I'm gonna go to is Angelic Mouse or Angelic Mouse. I don't know how you say it. <laughs> 
All right then, let's start looking for these candies. You can check around this general mountain area though, in case there is any. Aha, yeah, I remember this cove. There's one little one in here. There it is. Boop. And I believe, I'm not sure if it was here. Um, yes, it was here. There is a little cave. And I remember this from Easter too. And there's one on Angelic Mal here. And there's also one on this um, torch here too. So I think that's all in here. I can't imagine there being three. So kind of just jump up and so I think that should be all for this little mountain hill thing here. I don't think there is any more. And then we can head over to the home store where the clothes are. And there's one behind this sign, the donation sign. Okay, there is one on the bridge right in the middle. Okay, so let's take a look around this home store. There's one right here. There's one on this pumpkin. There's one on these clothes here, right in the middle. There's another over here. And there's some on the stairs up here, on the first to the right. Oh, I can't get up, there we go. I think that's all for up this section. All right, so I'm gonna check in here. And there's one where this blue torch is, to the right. There is one behind this giant spider, just here. Okay, so in this section, there's one directly in the middle here. Can't miss it. And there was a few in here. I can see two, one on this model. Oh, and there's one on this grave, and one on this model's head. Okay, so if you were to fall down from the spawn section up there, where the bridge starts, there is a little candy on this rock down here, just located here. Another one I missed is located just behind this statue over here. I'm not sure how I uh, missed that one, because it was quite a large uh, sweet candy. Okay, so the last one is located one, two, three, um, of the shops down up on the left side or the right side depending on which way you're facing and it's just here I'm not sure how I look past this but uh, I still did so let's go back to Davinia and see what we got so we got the abnormally large and very pokey fork and 250 diamonds so let's take a look there it is so it's just a little devil's like uh, stuff horn thing i'm not sure what it's called but that's it all right let's go to alamort for the next one all right just 20 to find in this store so let's get started as soon as we come in there's one right over here someone's left their hat on the floor on this tree there's one and on the bottom of the stairs there's one right on the corner there there's one on this little model here Right behind this model sitting on the crescent moon, there's a big candy behind there too. And on top of this model's head, there's a little candy. And in front of these two models, there's candy too. Right, I'm going to check outside first. Right, as you come out the door to the left, there's a candy just sitting here. Over here, there's this mysterious little hole in the ground. Let's see what's down here. Ooh, spooky. Let's get the lantern out. Ooh, a candy. And another candy, awesome. Gotta come through this little gap here. No, I didn't go this way. There we go. There's another one. Let's go straight on here. 
another candy in here too. There's another one. I have no idea where I am now. Um, here's another candy. <laughs> and there's another candy. I feel like, um, you know an avatar in like the spirit world where there's like that sort of pit that's full of fog and it just keeps keeps people like stuck there that's what that maze felt like to me um i'm gonna go upstairs and see what's up here one on this bottle's head right here and one in the corner over here all oh, right there is one that i missed in here so i'm guessing the other one is down here too i just didn't check all of these paths correctly And here's the last one, got it. There we go. Just stick with this maze, you'll find them all eventually. You just gotta sort of methodically go through all the different pathways and memorize where you have and haven't been. So there we go, let's go back to Earth and see what we won. Okay, so we won 800 diamonds from that home store.